Hello and welcome to my channel. Today, we are going to talk about a book that I just finished reading called, The House in the Pines, by Jane Doe. This book has been on my to-read list for a while, and I finally got around to it. And, let me tell you, it did not disappoint. Synopsis. The House in the Pines, tells the story of a young woman named Sarah who inherits a cabin in the woods from her grandmother. As she spends time there, she discovers secrets about her family's past and the town's dark history. Sarah is determined to uncover the truth, but the more she digs, the more danger she puts herself in. Characters. Sarah is the main character in the book. She's a strong-willed, independent woman who is determined to find out the truth about her family's past. She's also a bit of a risk-taker, which can get her into trouble at times. The other important character in the book is the town itself. The town has a dark and mysterious past, and the more Sarah learns about it, the more she realizes that the town is hiding something. The town almost feels like a character itself, and it adds to the overall sense of unease and tension in the book. Themes. One of the main themes of the book is the idea that the past can come back to haunt us. Sarah's family has a dark past, and as she tries to uncover the truth about it, she puts herself in danger. The book also explores the idea of the sins of the father being visited upon the son, or in this case, the granddaughter. Another theme is the idea of isolation. Sarah is alone in the cabin in the woods, and she feels very isolated. This isolation adds to the tension and unease in the book. Conclusion. Overall, I really enjoyed, The House in the Pines. It's a well-written book with interesting characters and a compelling plot. If you like mystery and suspense novels, I highly recommend it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.